Good morning, everyone, and welcome to day five on board the Norwegian Bliss. We are docked in Icy Strait Point today in Alaska, and today I'm excited to try the local bar and grill for breakfast. So let's go ahead and check out this new experience, which I've never done before on board a Norwegian ship. Here we go. And be sure to hit that like button, everyone. And if you're not subscribed, please do subscribe to my channel and also enable those notifications. All right, guys, coming to the local bar and grill for the first time for breakfast, and let's take a look at some of the menu options. What would you order if you were here today? I got my eyes on the buttermilk pancakes and the fruit salad. Gotta get some fruit, right guys? <laughs> yeah, this is the menu for the local barn girl breakfast. Again, very different from the, you know, the buffet and the dining room and also the observation lounge as well. But this is cool to come and check out. And you can see here, it's not too busy right now. I mean, there's folks also here sitting and having breakfast, but most of the folks have gone off the ship as we are docked in Icy Strait Point today. So yeah, here we go. All right, guys. Uh, and today for breakfast, I got the buttermilk pancakes with some butter and some maple syrup. And of course, I got to get the seasonal fruit plate as well. Uh, you got to eat a little healthy as well, right? So you got the, getting the day started off right, have a nice light breakfast. And again, I'm really happy about this because I've, I've never ever been to the local bar and grill for breakfast. So I'm really happy about this. And again, it's not busy. And I highly recommend this uh, venue for your breakfast uh, options as well. When you come on board the Norwegian Bliss or the Norwegian Encore as well to Alaska. Look at that, yummy, yummy in my tummy, tummy. Here we go. I can take a nice walk up these stairs. You know, my favorite course of all time is the elevator to success is closed, but the stairs are open. So no matter what you want to do in life, put your mind to it, believe in yourself, have the courage to pursue it, and you can be anything and everything you want in life. I'm a perfect example, guys. Keep working. I mean, times when they do crew drills on certain port days, a lot of guests are off the ship, right? But you can see that all these LED lights light up all across the hallway and really all over the ship. So it's pretty cool. I'm going to show you guys some other, uh, you know, lights as well. See here, basically everywhere you look, on the stairs, near the elevator, bank, everything, right? There's lights everywhere. And again, this is just for crew, right? Guests don't have to participate or do anything, right? This is only for crew, just in case there are, you know, there's a scenario in case there were ever a real emergency. There's the emergency drill just for the crew. All right, guys, here we are in Icy Strait Point. And as you can see here, there's the other dock that I've normally docked at with Royal Caribbean. And of course, we're located at the other dock just a little bit south of where that location is, right? So uh, again, it's a rainy and kind of cloudy day today. Cold, about 55 degrees. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to check out some views and sights and sounds. I guess wanted to just give you another perspective. It is raining, so uh, this is where we have tied the lines. And as you can see here, there is the dock that folks will uh, walk off the ship from and then of course head into town and there's a little tram there that they can actually take into the main town area of course where that you know killer whale statue is and the shops and the restaurants and all that good stuff so yeah again kind of a cloudy and rainy day here in the uh, icy straight point as you can see here we got some of the folks on the tram right there you can see the tram is still moving as they head up into the clouds it's a little bit foggy up there but um yeah the trams are still running i don't know if the zip line is running today as you can see up there I'm not hearing any zip zippers. <laughs> so I, if I do hear, I'll try to record it for sure. But it looks like, I'm not sure if the zip uh, line excursion is running today due to the weather. So yeah, stay tuned. Okay, so the zip line excursion is running, I, I believe. So if you look here, you can see those, I can hear the sound of the, the actual you know, devices that carry the zip liners down, right, the mountains. So I do see them moving. I don't know if you can see them, the little red, uh, red dots. So I'm gonna try to get some footage of the folks who are going to come next and let's see how fast they go again it's really fast this is the uh, tallest and fastest zip liner in the country all right guys just waiting for the zip liners to go down uh, I know they go pretty fast, so I'm gonna try to capture this for you guys. And you can see here, while we're waiting, uh, you can see the, the tram that's going up the mountain and down the mountain as well. You get some amazing scenic views. And of course, today it's being really cloudy. On a very clear day, again, ideal weather conditions, you can see for miles and miles. And of course, you can see our, your ship that you arrive on is very small, because that's it's a pretty high altitude up there, right guys? So uh, yeah, not today, unfortunately, because of the weather. Hey guys, welcome to rainy Icy Strait Point in Alaska. Today is Wednesday, June 28th, and uh, it's gonna be a cloudy day, obviously, right? Rainy, and of course, that's just the weather today. 
Uh, it's been kind of a good weather, bad weather, good weather, bad weather type of cruise, which is fine, right? You can't predict it with Alaska, so. Um, but yeah, just gonna, just gonna kind of walk around the ship and explore a bit more. I have no plans to get off, just like the other ports, um, just because I wanna, I came for the ship mostly, right? So it's gonna be a great day, and uh, I'm looking forward to my YouTube live later on in the day as well. So I know you guys will probably watch this after the fact, but th thanks for coming to my YouTube live. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Appreciate you all very much. Here they go, guys. It's hard to see. I'm gonna make a zoom in a little bit. They are zipping away. Oh my goodness, look how fast they're going. That is so cool. Check it out. Yeah, <laughs> they are flying. And of course you can really feel in here uh, once you're actually in the town, right? But it's really cool. You can hear from a distance, it's amazing, guys. But yeah, so I guess it's raining and showery today, but um, as you guys see in my video. But um, hey, you know, we're making the most of it. Folks are having a good time. As you can see, folks are heading into town right there. That is the main dock to connect to town and then you take a little tram to get to the main town area. So um, yeah, this is uh, just how it is in Alaska. Hey guys, decided to take a little break and sit down since I've been on my feet all day. And I guess I'm just here on the waterfront, deck eight on the Norwegian Bliss. And I just kind of taking in the views and just relaxing really because it's kind of a, you know, rain day. Oh, here, zip line. There they go. You see them? I love that sound. That's so cool. They're going super fast, guys. Like, it's probably like, look at that. That's crazy. I love it. That's so awesome. Yeah, so I was saying, just kind of hanging out on the waterfront, just kind of chilling and enjoying the views. It's a rainy day today, so I'm not getting off as well. But um, yeah, just, you know, hanging out, you guys can see here. Got the nice, uh, you know, waterfront right there. And then I'll show you guys this part of here. Right, it's, just, it's just me here, because I think a lot of people have gone off the ship, which is cool. But yeah, I'm just hanging out, guys. Had a nice breakfast. You know, continue walk around, take more footage and content that I'll be sharing. And uh, yeah, you can have lunch and then, you know, the day will be gone before we know, who knows. And again, I'm looking forward to my live. And of course, we have Jersey Boys tonight. So I'm excited for that main production show in the Bliss Theater. Jersey Boys is gonna be awesome. They're doing just, uh safety testing and that was the horn and of course the siren as well so pretty cool all right guys and here is the main dock area as you can see there's some folks who are waiting to get on board on a boat excursion and this is the the bridge that takes you across to the mainland area of icy street point and again, there's the there's the tram for perspective right up there on the left uh, but yeah this is it like it's a, a wet, wet and rainy day today a uh, cold day, about 55 degrees here in Icy Street Point, Alaska, but that's not going to stop folks from having a good time, right? So, there you go. All right, guys, I am back at the buffet. Of course, this is my daily tradition on board the Norwegian Bliss. I got to get my Indian food on. We got some chili pakoras, we got some dal, we got some aloo gobi, we got some kuchumbur salad, raita, some chutneys, some naan, some papadam. And I think that's everything. <laughs> and of course, check out this view, guys. We are here at Icy Street Point, and again, it's really coming down out there, but this is a beautiful view, and uh, the buffet just opened up around 11.30, and of course, I always want to try to beat the rush before everyone gets back on, because the buffet gets really packed for lunch. Actually, for every meal, it's really busy, so if you can take advantage of it and get here before others do, if they're at port, I highly recommend it. Check it out. Love it. All right, guys, you can see it's a very rainy day here in Icy Street Point, Alaska. Uh, it's coming down, and you can see on the observation lounge windows, here's the front of the ship. Pretty foggy up there. Got a boat out there as well. Still some excursions happening, right? I don't remember everything being canceled, but uh, it's just very, very rainy. You can see it's coming down pretty good. Hey guys, it's about 2.30 p.m. here in Icy Street Point, Alaska. And I was like, you know, get a little you know, mid-afternoon snack. And of course I got this delicious Tom Yum Soup, uh, vegetarian broth. It's, a, it's definitely a soup kind of day for sure because it's raining outside and it's cold and this is gonna hit the spot right before my YouTube live so here we go. Guys, all aboard is in two minutes and we have a few folks who are coming just at the nick of time. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna have any peer runners today but there's a potential for peer runners. I'm just looking around see if I can maybe pick some up now. There's, there's still a few people out there. Um, they're kind of taking their first time which is fine but again all aboard is in less than two minutes so I'm sure they'll wait for them, I can clearly see them, but I don't know if that means they're gonna start running or what, but they gotta hurry up. <laughs> Guys, all the port time is now, and we still got a lot of people out there. Let's see if we can get some uh, peer runners today. 
<laughs> if you look at the staff right here, they're just kind of wandering. All right, I'm gonna head down to deck eight. All right, guys, all aboard is done, and it looks like those might be the last two passengers that are gonna remove the lines here pretty soon, and we'll be officially sailing away from Icy Strait Point. Uh, the rain has stopped, which is awesome, and it's just gonna be just cloudy, and it's actually not super cold either. I mean, I'm wearing my jacket, but it feels very comfortable here. And again, I'm getting ready to do my YouTube live sail away from Icy Strait Point, so be sure to tune into that on demand replay in my live section on my YouTube channel. <laughs> and just for reference, you know, we're at this dock today. Normally, we dock over there where my finger is. Uh, that's where the Norwegian Encore was docked and also where we did with Royal Caribbean as well. So um, a little bit of a different tender or different port that we docked at here today. So um, kind of nice. And of course, there's the tram. And of course, the zip lining experience. I actually talked to a lady from my Facebook group. Uh, I think her name was Vicky. She said it was a lot of fun, very exhilarating. So also to mention that on the waterfront, they also have a Dolce Gelato shop. So get your choice of gelatos here and right inside is the bake shop as well so let me actually show you guys that real quickly and you got vanilla chocolate strawberry and of course a bunch of other options that you can enjoy and here in the bake shop we have some other awesome treats and delicious items as you can see here it's very similar to coco's oh they got macaroons cupcakes some other options as well so yeah there you go this is the bake shop hey guys just got done with an amazing youtube live for over two hours and then afterwards i hung out with a lot of fellow cruisers at the mojito bar of course the amazing bartenders aliandro and marcial it was a great time i got there for a couple hours and here now it's like about 7 p.m on wednesday june 28th and i decided to come to the garden cafe again for dinner because it's quick it's easy and they have indian food so i love it but yeah i got amazing views guys i'm gonna show you in just a second for dinner tonight got rajma some tomato rice some dal chutney paracha papadum some chutneys and some sabji as well got my water to hydrate and look at this view guys this is the view to have at dinner We are on our way to Ketchikan, Alaska, and it's turned out to be a beautiful evening. I think it stopped raining, which is great too, but you can see out there the seas, and you have the beautiful surroundings of us with the mountains and everything. I mean, this is Alaska, but it's finest, right guys? It's absolutely beautiful. It's just so cool, like, it's our fifth night here on the bliss, and you can see the sun kind of peeking through the clouds. And when it does make an appearance, you can see kind of like, you can actually look at it, but you can see how the sun is shining through those clouds right there. That's pretty cool. Look how pretty that is. An amazing dinner at the Garden Cafe. And decided to keep it at the buffet tonight just because the Indian food options were great and it's quick service. Well, self-serve, <laughs> really. Look at that, how pretty is that? It's got this like nice bright shiny light in the water. That's so cool. See the sun slowly trying to make an appearance out through those clouds. Oh, oh, not yet, almost. It's pretty. I love it. We're at the very front of the ship. Again, that's the bridge. It's not to be a beautiful evening. The rain has stopped, which is great. It's gonna be a fun evening ahead. Got uh, gonna walk to digest all my dinner, and then got Jersey Boys at 9:30, and then there's a 70 70s party, which I'll probably check out for a little bit. And that's it. And then tomorrow is day six in Catch Can. So again, thank you everyone for watching today's vlog. It's been a fun experience, and more to come. Thank you again. And special shout out to all my Patreon and YouTube members. Thank you so much for your additional support. If you'd like to become a Patreon or YouTube member, I'll include the links in the description below. It's basically a behind the scenes view of cruising with JT and special access to various benefits and perks and inside information. 
into my upcoming videos. So if you do decide to join, I truly appreciate your support. This video is sponsored by MEI Travel. Feel free to reach out to me at cruisingwithjt at gmail.com and I'll get you connected to my travel agent at MEI Travel. She'll take great care of you. And I'll also include the information in the description below. Thank you so much. <music>